Now, the former Etegwini Mayor Zandi Lekumete and her co-accused are due back in the High Court in Durban today. They are facing fraud and corruption charges relating to a Durban solid waste tender worth more than 300 million rand. ENCS Desen Thalthi is covering the story for us and joins us now. Good morning, Desen. What are we expecting today in court? Well, in Funda, when it eventually does get underway, we're told that will be after 11. It's meant to be the pre-trial conference ahead of the trial, which is scheduled for next month. So uh, it promises to be fairly brief. But remember, this has been long and drawn out so far. The former Etikmini mayor was arrested in 2019. She and the other co-accused have been in court several times over this 320 million rand fraud case. But it's going to be very interesting to watch what plays out when that trial eventually gets underway. If you had to look at that indictment, it's almost 400 pages. It'll really make your head spin when you look at all of the figures and all of the the amounts of money that have moved around. Remember, the state is alleging here that Kumede and others in this matter were running a criminal enterprise. So they had found creative ways of moving the municipal money around to ensure that in everyone benefited in some way. Kumede herself is accused of getting almost 2.8 million rand in those kickbacks. And that was in, in various forms, whether it was money directly to her, whether it was benefits to, uh, to, to those around her, and even items like airtime and, and building supplies for a home. So there are over 2,700 charges here. And as I mentioned, the state is really going to have its work cut out for it to prove that, in fact, this was the case and that Kumede and the other players, such as the contractors, the subcontractors, the former city manager, councillors and others, were all, of it, were all involved in trying to defraud the city of 320 million rand. Mm. It should be an interesting day in court today. Desen, will leave it there for now. That's our reporter, Desen Thalthia, just monitoring the Zandile Gumede fraud case for us. More news and updates.